pushing. Sam Briggs is off on her final berm run. In the seven events that we've seen so far, no one has won more than one event. Sam Briggs looking to be the first woman to win two events here at the 2016 Reebok CrossFit Games. Chrissy Aramo, the game's rookie as an individual, working her way back up the top, trying to put some pressure on Carrie Pierce and Sarah Sigmund's daughter. Sigmund's daughter's off on the run, as is Carrie Pierce, and Chrissy Aramo is right behind the two of them. That is your leader in this heat. She's trying to chase down Churi Helga Daughter's winning time of 13 minutes, 19.56 seconds. Samantha Briggs had a tough time making sure she was going to be able to come here for the games from overseas. And she was telling me earlier she was really hoping that that stressful week before the games wouldn't affect her performance. As you can see, far ahead in the lead here, she still seems to be doing a good job. While many of the athletes came to California and in other parts in the southwest, Las Vegas, uh, some parts of Northern California to get acclimated to the heat, Sam Briggs literally showed up a couple days before this competition started. Sam Briggs spent a, a lot of time, though, over here. She's comfortable here. You know, she's previous games winner. This is her fifth games. It's more like home when you get here for, for Sam. Sam Briggs making the final descent into the soccer stadium. Two rope climbs and then a final snail push of 40 feet. And she is on pace to win event number eight and most likely get herself on top of the overall leaderboard. Meanwhile, on the right, Sarah Sigmund's daughter, who is in second place, is getting passed by Carrie Pierce for second place. Chrissy Aramo is behind her, and Kristen Holta in the yellow behind Aramo. But on the bottom left, there goes Sam Briggs, who's Finally locking in her legs. Probably could have done that whole thing legless. Makes the touch. And she'll have one more to go before a final 40-foot snail push. Again, you see the black line at the top on the rope. That's where the athletes have to have their hands on the rope as they decline down towards the pad before they can drop off. But it is smart to drop. You don't want to hold on any longer than you have to. Save that grip. Sarah Sigmund's daughter has passed Carrie Pierce as the two of them are followed by Kristen Holta and Chrissy Aramo. But doesn't look like anybody's going to catch Sam Briggs here. She just has 40 feet to go with that 400-pound snail. And Sam Briggs looking to become the first woman this year to win two events. And there's a very good chance Samantha Briggs could move herself into first place. It depends where Tia Toomey and Sarah Sigmund's daughter finish. So much composure, so much confidence with Sam Briggs when she gets out there and gets on a run. That was a good hit, much better than that shoulder push that she did earlier. Briggs inching her way to the finish line. More than a minute to go before we hit Turi Helgadotter's top time. The crowd trying to bring Samantha Briggs home. And it's going to be event win number two for Samantha Briggs, the ninth event win of her CrossFit Games career, and she will earn 100 points.